22 of the 24 days of December. We are looking at both the tea and the cheese. And yes, as you've noticed, I am doing the 24 drunken days of December. So please feel free to join me for that in the evenings. Tonight, let's see what we have in the way of tea and cheese. And I just about used my drip cup for my tea. That, that would have been bad. All right, today's tea, day two. Day two we have, I'm just gonna put this down here because well, you know, I, I like to be seen. Day two is Organic Cream of Earl Grey. I've had this one before. It's delicious. Now this one you probably could use with some cream and sugar or milk and sugar, whatever you choose. For me, I'm drinking it straight black and we're gonna see what we've got. Ugh. Aside from spices and everything else and everything nice, let's have a quick peek. And again, this is for two people. So I'm just gonna do one for now because there's a lot in this one. I could do it and fill it up, get a stronger tea going. I'm gonna get a different cup that's smaller. All right, we're gonna let that steep. And while that's steeping, we're gonna look at what kind of cheese we have. So let's see. Day two for cheese. There's one. Three, 15, nine, 24. Day two. Day two's cheese is the Applewood. Oh, the smoked one. This would go really well with actually with the uh, Earl Grey. I'll let that steep some more. All right, so let's have a look at the uh, cheese, shall we? Now, you've seen my videos before, you know that I've had the applewood before. There's that smoke smell. A little bit of a, oh, mm. I could smell this cheese all day. This is an amazing cheese. All right, well, down the hatch. It's not as creamy as last time, but it's still really delicious. Has that beautiful, a little bit of a bitter back note or bitter bite to it. That smokiness comes off well. And cheddar in there, mm, just, mm. Oh yeah, this, this is delicious. And it's the original recipe too, okay. So that explains why it's a little bit more crumbly. This is one of my favorite cheeses from them. Yeah, that's, that's really good. That's delicious. All right, so now the tea. Well, I thought I cleaned this properly. I, apparently I did not. Oh well. The smell. Definitely has that black tea quality to it. You do get a sweetness off there. It actually smells pretty damn good. Yeah, I like that. Now again, for a Earl Grey, I do like to have a little bit of cream or milk with it. Milk, because I don't like cream in my tea. I only like cream in my coffee. And then it's even debatable. The taste. Got a little bit of a sweetness in there. A little bit of the cream quality. Do you have the mild spices that you get in an Earl Grey? Again, I'm using too big of a cup for this. If I had a smaller one, I'd probably get more concentrated flavors. But since I've got a bigger one, it's a little bit harder to get those flavors. I 
overall, again, this is delicious. I really like this. Well, for a rating for day two, for enjoyment, personal enjoyment, it's gonna be a nine out of 10 or a 4.5 out, 4 out of five. For different stuff, the, the tea is delicious. It's a beautiful tea. I like the cream of Earl, or Earl Grey cream or cream of Earl, well, what is it? Earl Grey cream, organic cream of Earl Grey. You see, French I read and then I read the English. It's really enjoyable. Again, a little bit of milk wouldn't hurt, but that's me. The Applewood, great, great cheese. One of my favorite cheeses. Really do enjoy it. So tell me, have you had this before? Uh, do you like it, do you not like it? My actual scores that I was going to do before saying that last line, what? I'm, I'm having a day. The tea, four out of five. The cheese, solid five out of five. That's my favorite one. I, I, I really do like it. Till next time, till tomorrow, till day three of the 24 days of December. I am Dan, AKA the Western Canadian Reviewer, and this has been day three, day two. Day two, I'm getting ahead of myself. Don't wanna do that. We'll see you real soon. Thanks again for joining. Have yourselves a wonderful and safe evening. And uh, by all means, please come around, enjoy. We'll see you real soon. Cheers. Now we can do it. Stupid battery error. Oh, what a pain in the ass.